Today, we're taking a deep dive into the dark side of aviation history. We're counting down the top seven deadliest crashes involving the once ubiquitous Boeing 727. These tri-jet workhorses dominated the skies for decades, but even the most reliable machines can fail. Here, we'll explore the tragic events that claimed hundreds of lives and forever changed aviation safety protocols. Did you know a single maintenance error turned a routine flight into a fiery inferno, killing everyone on board? We'll reveal the shocking cause of this Mexican nightmare and six other horrifying crashes that shook the world. Stay tuned as we uncover the human stories, investigate the contributing factors, and learn the valuable lessons gleaned from these tragedies. The Boeing 727 may be grounded today, but its history, both good and bad, is a vital part of aviation's evolution. United Airlines Flight 389, August 16, 1965 a new 727-100 crashed into Lake Michigan near Chicago's O'Hare Airport. All 30 people on board perished, and investigators couldn't determine why the plane continued its descent into the water. American Airlines Flight 383, November 8, 1965. This 727-100 crashed on approach to Greater Cincinnati Airport. Only three passengers and one flight attendant survived. The crew's failure to monitor altimeters during deteriorating visibility conditions caused the accident. United Airlines Flight 227, November 11, 1965 Departing from New York City, this 727-100 crashed on landing at Salt Lake City International Airport, the captain's steep approach led to the deaths of 43 of the 91 people on board. All Nippon Airways Flight 60, February 4, 1966. Approaching Tokyo's Haneda Airport at night, this 727-100 crashed into the sea, killing all 133 on board. Pan Am Flight 708 November 15, 1966. A 727-100 crashed near Dahlgau, Germany, during initial approach to Tegel Airport. The cause remains unexplained, and the three crew members died. Piedmont Airlines Flight 22, July 19, 1967. Colliding with a Cessna 310 shortly after takeoff from Asheville Regional Airport, all 79 passengers and crew on the 727, along with three people in the Cessna, lost their lives. Mexicana de Aviación Flight 940, March 31, 1986. A 727-200 crashed into El Carbon Mountain in Mexico's Sierra Madre Occidental Range, killing everyone on board during a flight from Mexico City to Los Angeles. In your opinion, which of the crash is deadliest? Don't forget to like and subscribe for more captivating content. Until next time, stay safe and fly high.